Much anticipated 162nd Le Moran King's Plate kicked off and one of the oldest horse racing events. While it's the first equestrian event for the year to take place at the Kenilworth Racecourse, it's rated one of the top horse racing events internationally, attracting thousands of people from all over the country and beyond. As everyone I'm sure has realized, it's gone from king to queen to king as the monarch has changed. So it's the first year being the king's plate for 70 years, of course. But we're so proud of the association with the royal family and we really want to keep in with that tradition, which is why we so subscribe to that name change. This year's horse racing event paved way for the first time for an all-female lineup in the Okapi Ladies International. I've worked with this horse as a yearling like two years ago and it is very good that I've been reunited with her and she was still the same filly that I loved, still loved. So yeah, she's got a special place in my heart at the moment. She took me to the finishing line. She's got a big heart and she raised herself out. Six-time King Plate winner. It's really a special race to win. Well done to um, Mrs. Rupert and the whole team. And uh, very privileged to, to win the King's Plate, the first King's Plate. So I can go down in history. Won this race, um, now it's my sixth time. So very happy and uh, just proud to, to be a part of such a good uh, team. Most of the credit must go to the horse. I mean, he really dug down deep and at uh, the end of the day, they're the heroes. The annual King's Plate attracts thousands of Mzanzi's A-listers and fashionistas stepping up to the plate and dressing to the nines. Local and international guests are dressed in their most elegant attire while sticking to the dress code, turning the race course a wash with blue and white. I'm loving to see men just being confident and being out there and taking risks. I think it's all about that and I think the common sense of what masculinity is is all out the window really. I think we must all just challenge what masculinity is and I see a lot of men doing that. For Newsroom Africa on Channel 405, I'm Nasipi Same in Cape Town.